Sebastian, this is for you, Anthony. Sebastian almost had a date with what gigantic movie star after flirting with her very publicly on James Corden? Ooh. Ooh. All right. Uh, very publicly. Man, I hope it's Rihanna because that's who I would flirt <laughs> with publicly. <laughs> yeah, I mean, that would have definitely been uh, an interesting show. But... <laughs> no, who was it? Who was it? I'm trying to think of that song that that she had when she was in the in that movie. She was a she's a singer. No, Mm-mm. no, Sharon Stone. I can't remember the the song in Casino when she's. I was just like, gonna say in Casino, she uh, throws the oh, chips. Yeah, when they're like, dun, dun, baby, and then, and then like De Niro just watches. I would, I would, if I like a Sharon Stone, I would go on a date with um, Jamie Lee Curtis. Oh, oh Jamie Lee Curtis too, and and that James Ca- and True Lies. I mean, that was a whole other thing. Season in True Lies made How you think you twice were? about the domestic life. Yo, <laughs> great places. It was so beautiful in trading places. Oh, Jamie Lee Curtis, golf clap. <laughs> How old were you when True Lies came out? How how old was little Anthony when he saw that? Maybe because they shot it in New they shot part of it in New Orleans. So uh I was I remember going out to the lakefront and they had that Harrier jet that took off and still on like I mean uh Schwarzenegger flew off in it to shoot the truck with the missiles. Uh so I was like 14, 15. I was a kid. Yeah. That's why that strip tease had a huge impact on you. <laughs> exactly. <laughs> it changed my life. <laughs> That's about the same age I was when I first saw Sliver. Oh, oh well. Well, see? there you go. And let me tell you, I didn't think the same about going out to dinner for a couple of years. 